Hi again, how are you today? We are going to talk today about uh, relationships and especially friendship. One of the most common things I find in, in my work in, in the school, in the Casenori Bugay school, is the difficult uh, people have to discriminate positive uh, relationships and positive uh, friendships. Uh, uh, as it is normally said, or maybe it should be normally said, uh, friendships are there to for you to be enhanced, for you to enhance others. They are there for people to reassure other people in their qualities, to give them wisdom for their lives, to encourage them to take decisions. You know, a friend is a person that when you are down, uh, when you feel down because you didn't pass that exam, it is a person that, that tells you that, that, you are, that you are capable of doing it, that maybe helps you analyze why this happened, how this happened, how can it not happen again, how can it be solved and, and you can recover your position and, 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 and maybe pass on your second chance. It is the person that when you have, when you, when you broke with, with your boyfriend or girlfriend, it is, and you feel really bad because, because maybe you feel guilty that you are not a good person. It's the person that reminds you that, that that's not the truth and that you are a, a nice person, a good person. And, and it's the person that always gives you a, a grow message. It is not the person that that, 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 use you, that uses you as a validation, as a vehicle of validation for them. It's not, it's not the, the person that, that, that makes you feel dumb and that build themselves out of you, which is quite common, which is quite common. Maybe, normally we go, we go with people that, that don't, that, that don't make real, real contributions to our lives. And, and many times it's because because we have a fear to, to not to be validated, not to be validated. And, and, and as we talked in an in a earlier video about COSMAU, um, it's normally, it's, it's quite common that, that if you remember that there are some instincts that make us, um, make us feel trapped, make that, that trap our mind and that, that make our actions not to be conscious, not to be, not to be proper. What is what we normally do? Normally we construct friendship out of luck, out of uh, the society we are born, the place we are born, the school we went, the class, the people that were was in our, in our classroom, in, our, in the class with us. So maybe, maybe people with whom we share like, likes and uh, maybe people with whom we share self-destruction habits you know there, there is a quite common drug friendship that that normally finishes in nothing a kind of friendship night friendship alcohol friendship destruction friendship it shouldn't be the the the, the way that friendship means something in your life It is quite common to that the, your friends are your, your partner's friends, and that you you just arrive uh, to a people to people that became your friends and you got accommodated, and you you got you felt comfortable and and, and you you got stuck in your comfort zone, and maybe you have nothing to do with your partner's friends, and and. Uh, you are stuck there, so so maybe you should reconsider that. Other times, um, people just like you, 
because you make them feel strong or make because as I told you before they they use you to validate themselves they make you feel dumb because they need to feel strong it is said that uh, you are the average of the people of the five ten people that surround you and this is quite true even on a spiritual uh, level if you don't if you are not uh, excellent on your choices you are bringing to your lives to your life um, not only bad things but the cost of opportunity not to 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 be able to to develop good things it is not to go with perfect people as i told you in an earlier video to go with perfect people is just a misunderstanding of what perfection should be um, and, it, and it just impoverishes your circle of, of surrounding circle um, and it is not it is not uh, it is neither to cut relations to break relations with everyone no no it is just to grow yourself from inside to outside and uh, out of this to to be capable of reorientate your relationships and many of them are gonna stay with you but on a more healthy way some of them will go away but this is for sure good for you and, and for the other person so don't, don't, don't worry about that stay conscious be, be, be real careful because it is quite common it is quite that is a difficult process to to realize who's good for you and who's bad for you. Sometimes it is your subconscious, uh, subconscious. What what will, will will tell you, or maybe it's just a dream situation you have in dreams with that person, which is telling you that something's wrong. Maybe it's just a kind of uncomfortable feeling that you have. In any case. Um, to to pay attention to relation to your relations is gonna be a key behavior in your life. So so I encourage you to to reflect on this, to test it this week, and uh, we will see you. We, we will see us next week. Thank you very much.